This is the most powerful law of attraction technique in the world. Repeat it every night before bed and witness the transformation. This magical word has been used for over 2,000 years by some of the most successful people on the planet. If you say it consistently, especially before sleeping, like a mantra, it can create enormous changes in your life. In fact, this word is the key to abundance in any area, whether it's health, money or love. Entrepreneurs who practice this word are more likely to become millionaires. People who want to enhance their romantic relationships see them thrive when they use this word, even if they are going through tough times. And those facing health challenges can experience dramatic improvements by empowering themselves with this word. Let me help you understand what I mean. The Bible says, For to everyone who has, more will be given, and he will have an abundance. But from him who does not have, even what he has will be taken away. This is from the Gospel of Matthew. Similarly, in the Quran it says, And remember when your Lord proclaimed, If you give thanks, I will give you more of my blessings. But if you are thankless, verily my punishment is severe. Both the Bible and the Quran speak continually about gratitude. There's a saying that explains this. Gratitude is wealth and complaint is poverty. Have you noticed that people who constantly complain tend to experience lack in all areas of life? When a person complains about pain, it grows. When they complain about a lack of money or their work situation, they only attract more negativity. Complaining leads to poverty, whether material or emotional. On the other hand, those who appreciate the good things in their lives, whether it's their relationships, their job or their health, tend to experience more prosperity and abundance. When you focus on the good you already have, even if it's small, it grows. The same goes for health. Instead of focusing on what's wrong, appreciate the health you do have and you'll notice a transformation. That's the power of gratitude. When you complain, it amplifies negativity. But when you appreciate, it amplifies the positive. Think about the last few years, where we've been bombarded with so much negative information. When people focus on symptoms or problems, they tend to grow larger. But there's another path, a path of gratitude, which can act like a magic solution for health, relationships, and even financial struggles. Why am I talking about this simple word so much? Because figures from different religions and cultures have always emphasized gratitude. Muhammad taught that being thankful for what you have ensures you'll keep receiving more good things. Buddha shared a similar idea. By being content and grateful for what you have, you attract more positivity into your life. Let's talk about what to say before you sleep each night. But first, let me give more context. In Hinduism, Krishna accepted anything offered with joy. King David, who started as a shepherd in the Old Testament, became the king of Israel. He spoke about giving thanks to everything under heaven and earth. Make a list of ten things to be thankful for, and by the time you reach nine, you'll struggle to think of more, because we often overlook how much there is to be grateful for. Gratitude is wealth, and complaint is poverty. Remember this. When you express gratitude for what you have, it amplifies. Jesus always gave thanks before performing miracles. He acted as if the outcome had already happened. This idea of thanking in advance, of showing appreciation for what hasn't yet manifested, is incredibly powerful. It allows us to bring our dreams into reality. The Bible says in Romans to speak things that are not as though they were. This is how we create our reality through faith and gratitude. This ancient wisdom has been echoed by brilliant minds like Isaac Newton and Albert Einstein. Newton credited the geniuses before him for his discoveries, and Einstein famously said he gave thanks more than 100 times a day, 
So why did they emphasize gratitude? Because it opens the door to abundance. Now, what is the mantra you should repeat before bedtime? It's simple. Say thank you ten times with meaning. When you say it, connect your thoughts with your emotions. Most people go to bed thinking about their problems or what they watched on TV, but the key is to open the doors to your subconscious. As Jesus said, the kingdom of heaven is within you. By putting yourself in a mental and emotional state of gratitude, you unlock your best self. So before you sleep, repeat the word thanks with feeling. Not just for the things you can touch, but for who you are and the blessings around you. Let that gratitude sink in deeply as you drift off to sleep. This practice will open the doors to abundance in all areas of your life. Believe me, within just a few days, you'll begin to notice small yet significant changes in your world. I'm not asking you to simply listen to this. I want you to try it. Share your experience and make this a part of your nightly routine starting tonight. And don't just limit it to nighttime. Use the mantra during quiet moments in your day. Use it while waiting, walking, or during any idle time, and watch how your life transforms. Right now, you're at a pivotal moment in your life. Gratitude is the key that unlocks abundance. Start using it and prepare to be amazed.